Well, hello everyone. How are you? I have a read. It's nice and special and it's for men only, right? Men who identify as actual males, right? This is for you because it has to do with you um, as duties as a man and also with you and a woman, right? So this is male and female relationship, understand? A born male and a born female relationship. But the read is about a, a born male who identifies himself as a masculine male. Understood? Thank you. Well, so, to start off. It's a lot of hands in the pot. Yes, as usual, it's a lot of hands in the pot. A lot of hands trying to be in the pot. Got a lot of people to feed. Okay, so you have a lot of people to feed. And you are in the leadership role. You need some rest, though. You do, you've been doing entirely too much. That's the thing. You've been doing entirely too much. You need some rest as the male in the leadership role. So that's what I'm talking to, men in leadership roles. Men who are handling their business. Men who are taking care of home like they're supposed to. Right. You need some rest. And, yeah, you need rest. Because you're being a... Uh, Right, meaning. Look good, take right, look good and take care of home. But you just mean right now, so you need some rest to regroup, recuperate. Right. Get your act right. Right. Back in order. Let's see what else is going on. Let's see. So this is for people who are a positive support system, of course, and you are a positive support system. You have a positive support system. You're all about handling your business. You're not about allowing people to take you off of your focus, and that's a beautiful thing. You made a lot of sacrifices in life, and the sacrifices have yielded some beautiful, some beautiful things to you. You've acquired some beautiful assets in life and some beautiful skills in life. And you're also discovering some new things about yourself, which is beautiful. It's always great to discover new things about self. Let's see. You follow guidance. So you have older mentors or whatever. You have mentors in your life who helped you to make it through these hard periods within your life. So you've been able to, with also a woman's, a woman's touch, to remove all hindrances within your lives that didn't need to be there whatsoever. So now you are in your abundant phase. You guys, you fellas are receiving your abundance. You're receiving your inheritance. You're getting your gifts, right? You're getting what was promised to you because you also accomplished whatever task you were, you, you were assigned to do and you um, achieved your goals, right? When you achieve your goals, most of your goals have to do with money, right? So that's where the abundance come in, right? So you have achieved your goals and you have acquired wonderful assets and Everything is doing wonderful. You did not sacrifice for nothing. So if you haven't received your your rewards yet, trust and believe they're on their way. Because you have made your sacrifices. You have achieved your goal. And the guidance that you received was great guidance, right? So with that being stated, the changes that you wanted to make were made. Even if you don't see them yourself, other people will see them in you. Sometimes we don't see the changes within ourselves, but other people can see them first. So trust and believe that the changes have taken place and you will receive whatever rewards that you were promised, right? If you worked hard for something, trust me, the money will come in, right? Let's see with chickadees. <clears throat> There's plenty of chicks out here. There's plenty of them. There's plenty. But you want an authentic chick. Right. There's plenty of chicks out here. But you want an authentic chick. Yeah, you release that old playboy life. You're no longer interested. You guys, this group of guys is no longer interested in the playboy lifestyle. So you have released all of that. That 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 unnecessary fiery energy that led you to be with chicks that meant absolutely nothing to you and that didn't do anything but put you through a bunch of strife, right, and empty pockets, right, so you have seen the error of your ways when it comes to dealing with unnecessary females, and that's a beautiful thing, 
you have been inspired to find the proper woman for yourself. So this is a group of guys who is looking for the proper woman to possibly move forward to into a serious relationship. These are guys who want a serious relationship, but they are slowly learning how to weed out the, the, the terrible chicks to bring in, the terrible twos, right? They're, they're, they're getting rid of these crybaby chicks that get on your nerves and don't know how to live without a man and can't go five minutes without looking for a man and wondering where he at to a grown woman who is authentic, who brings peace, who is his peace, who is peaceful, and is his only peace, right? Yeah, you see, right? And you are his only peace, right? So, right, you're only on his pole. So, with that being stated, you two will more than likely end up at the justice of peace, right? So these are men that are looking for a group of women that are also chast, tired of trash, and ready to move forward and be grown and do grown people things, right? So understand that it will take place, right? You have received everything that you wanted to receive in the spirit, and it's only a matter of time before it's here in the natural if it hasn't already started to show, right? Women will come. The woman will come. There's plenty. And you also know that when you want something new, something different, some crazy come running your way first. Right? Pause and pray. Do them. Pause and pray. Right? Pause and pray. Right? Gotta let you know. Right? But sometimes you ain't even gotta pray. You just, right? So you know, you understand English quite well. So it's a beautiful thing. Guys don't like a whole lot of talk. So what you do is you have a wonderful day. Right.